So I recently purchased a new tennis racket, which is very exciting. Uh, I know it's a carbon copy of my previous racket, but it's still exciting buying new tennis rackets. Uh, the particularity of this racket is that I bought it used and the person I purchased it from had just recently strung it with a polyester string, uh, which I generally don't like to use. As I mentioned in the intro episode, I generally prefer a multi-filament string. Uh, the reason for that is, uh, well, there's a couple of reasons really. Uh, the main two I would say is for injury prevention. Polyester strings tend to be a little bit tougher on your arm. And seeing as I'm playing a lot of tennis right now, uh, an injury would be detrimental right now. So that's definitely a strong point. But really the main point is I don't need them. Uh, I mean, my multifilament gives me great feedback, great feel, uh, and I'm not breaking them very often. Um, polyester strings are really meant for, for high endurance for short periods of time. So for players with a lot of topspin uh, that are breaking multifilament or, uh, or a synthetic gut very fast, uh, that makes sense to switch to a polyester strings. Of course, people on tour, almost all of them use polyester strings because they would break uh, a multifilament too fast. Uh, but for them, obviously, they string their rackets every match, so it kind of makes sense. Um, for me, that would just be very expensive. So for now, I'm gonna stick to the multifilament, and if I ever need it, maybe I'd switch to a hybrid with polyester on the mains and, and multifilament on the crosses. But that's if my game starts improving drastically and I start breaking string very often, which is not the case for now. But seeing as I have both rackets, I thought I'd come out on the court and, uh, and we test out to see if I can actually feel a difference. See if I can get more spin or power or anything that's usually advertised with polyester strings uh, or not. Um, for the record, so this one, the green one right here is strung with a polyester string at 48 pounds and the red string is strung with a multifilament at 52 pounds. Um, so we're gonna try it out. Uh, I'm gonna do a couple backhands to see if I feel any difference. Um, doing backhands today, so we'll do some backhands. Uh, we'll do a couple balls with each and see if we feel the difference. I'll start out with the base model, which is just the multifilament, and then we'll move on to the polyester ones. That was the multi-filament and now we'll do the polyester.
So I can't, uh, I can't say I felt that big of a difference between the two strings. Definitely a little bit more stiffness uh, with the polyester string, but not enormous. Um, uh, definitely, again, I prefer the feel of the multi-filament. Uh, a little bit softer, uh, but very similar. I didn't get more spin or more power or anything like that with the polyester string. Um, <laughs> frankly, the biggest difference that I felt is, uh, not felt heard, is the, the sound that the ball makes when it makes contact with the polyester strings. Um, the sound that it makes with the, with the multi-filament is a little bit more muted, which I generally like. That's why I have the vibration dampeners uh, to dampen the, the, the sound. Uh, this is just something personal that I prefer. I, I prefer no sound uh, with the ball on the string bed. But, uh, but other than that, I didn't feel that big of a difference. Again, for injury prevention reasons and, and for the fact that I'm not breaking multi-filament, uh, that's really the, 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 best, uh, the best option for me. When I do start breaking them and it becomes a little bit more expensive having to restring them constantly, then I'll, I'll think about uh, changing the configuration, probably, as I said, to a hybrid with polyester on the mains and multi-filament on the crosses. But until then, uh, I'm very happy with my multi-filament. Uh, I'll keep on the polyester until, well, until it's no good anymore, which shouldn't be that long. I think a couple hours is all I'm gonna get uh, from it. But, uh, but yeah, multi-filament is, uh, is what I'm going to stick with uh, for now. All right, see you guys later.